Hey everyone, today we are starting a new 100% walkthrough for Wolfenstein Youngblood. 100% means we're going to be doing absolutely everything in this game and picking up all of the trophies. Now this game was chosen by my Patreon supporters just like all the games I play on this channel. So if you like what I'm doing here and you'd like to throw in some support, you can click the link on the screen or down in the description below, become a patron and vote on the games I play in the future. So before we get this game started, let's go over to the options, over to gameplay. You can see I've got the subtitles on for you guys. And I've also set the difficulty to its highest setting, which is challenging. Ultra hard difficulty setting for the fearless gamer. Looks good. Let's go ahead and start. Welcome to Wolfenstein Youngblood. You are one of the Blazkowicz sisters, Jess and Soph. You will now select your character in starting loadout. Since Jess and Soph are twins, they are equally proficient, so you will be able to use the same weapons and gear and learn all skills that the game has to offer. As you go through each selection, press square to view more information before making your choice. Alright, so we have Jess and Soph. Let's go ahead and play as Jess. Well, before I do that, let's read this. The Blazkowicz Sisters. Selecting which twin sister you want to play as is a cosmetic choice, as the abilities are the same for both sisters. However, Jess starts with the scoped Sturm... Sturmgewire? I'm... just murdered that, I'm sure. Which is a medium to long range weapon, while Soph carries a Kugelgewire with a drum magazine, which is a short to medium range weapon. During gameplay, all weapons and upgrades can be acquired no matter which sister you play. When joining a co-op session, you might be assigned a different sister than the one you have selected, based on the host player's preference. Alright, so like I said, gonna pick Jess. Starting appearance. Your appearance is a cosmetic choice which has no gameplay benefits, but allows you to kill Nazis with style. You can choose the color of your power armor and the style of your helmet. More appearance options can be acquired during the game if you want to try out different styles. Alright, so we can go with Golden Eagle. Or Blue Shark. I like the Golden Eagle. This probably has the same... Yeah, okay. So, Bolt Head Helmet or Hammer Head. I'm gonna go with the Hammer Head. Then, we have the Starting Pistol. Here you will choose what pistol to start out with. The Machine Pistol... The Machinen Pistol is a short-range weapon with a very fast fire rate, and it's effective against light enemies. You also get a drum magazine upgrade with this weapon. The pistol is a medium range weapon with a slow fire rate and it's effective against heavy enemies. It's also suitable for stealthy players as it comes with a silencer upgrade. All weapons and upgrades can be acquired later in the game. All right, so machine and pistol or a pistol. I think I wanna go with the pistol. Good for taking down heavy armor enemies. I think that'll be good for me. All right, then we have the melee weapon. This is where you choose what melee weapon to use. The melee weapon choice is cosmetic as both the hatchet and the knife are equally efficient. You will later be able to try out different types of knives and hatchets though, or through the weapon screen in your journal. All right, so knife or hatchet. Uh, I kind of like the knife. Let's go with the knife. Okay, then we have our starting ability. You get one ability for free at the start of the game. Crush is an offensive ability suitable for aggressive players. Sprint into light enemies to inflict damage and knock them to the ground. You can also perform a slam attack by pressing circle when midair. Uh, cloak is a stealth ability for sneaky players. Press down on the d-pad to become invisible for a limited time. Both of these abilities have higher power levels which you can unlock later by spending ability points. Um, so I tried out the stealth before, I wasn't actually a huge fan. So I'm thinking I might try Crush, although I'm not super aggressive, I guess. I don't know, I guess I'm moderately aggressive when I play this game. So we'll try Crush. I've not used it before, but maybe it's good. All right, that looks good. And then we have Pep Signals. Pep Signals are an important part of your tool set. Press up on the D-pad while in range of your sister to activate a boost that benefits both of you. Activating the thumbs up pep signal provides healing while the metal horns pep signal will restore armor instead You can acquire more pep signals later during the game and equip the one which best suits the situation uh, So I didn't Notice a huge benefit to either one. I 
I would say the armor pep is probably a little bit better just because armor seems to be more common in the game, so you're more likely to lose some armor and then get it back. Actually, that was a terrible description, but anyways, I like the armor pep because armor is much more likely to fluctuate, whereas your health, if you're doing well, will just kind of stay at max and then your health pep doesn't really help. So armor pep to me seems a little bit better, but I'm not super confident in relaying that information. So I'm going to go with armor, but health might be just as good. All right, and that is all of the starting choices that we have. Let's go ahead and finish. All right, so it is a co-op game. If you feel like playing with others, you are welcome to. I believe it also has local co-op, although I could be wrong on that. Uh, so I'm actually gonna be playing offline. I don't wanna be public, I wanna be offline. There, nobody, offline. And let's go ahead and start. Your head up, Jess. Come on now. What is that thing? Big horn. No idea what it's doing in these parts. Must have strayed from the flock. Five more. Looks scared. Yeah. Driven off by the storms, I reckon. I don't know about this. Can I take the shot? Uh-uh. Situation like this, you need to pay attention to your surroundings. Your mind will slip into that scope. Awareness will narrow to the head of a pin. You make sure while you're stalking that bighorn, you're still watching out for what's stalking you, baby. Good. Good, all right. All right, tell me what you're sensing. It's gonna rain soon. Good. What else? Uh, I don't know, there's a... There's a band of coyotes about 100 yards northeast of here. Five more, Zofia, kick! <gasps> kick! <gasps> Keep your hands up. Again. No, no more, Mama. This is how you die. This is the moment they get you. We die because we let them kill us. You will face a big, strong Aryan true believer who can push through pain for one second longer than you do. And that's all it takes. When does it stop, Mama? Listen, Kokanya, to survive is to embrace the suffering, to stand up and carry it. Okay? Teraz jeszcze pięć. Five more. Hey, language, Sofia. Daddy. Yep. What else? Daddy? Are you leaving? Holy shit. Holy shit. Situational awareness. It'll save your life. Come on now. Take your shot before the rains come. I was beginning to think you lacked that killer instinct. Screw you, Arthur. Ah, uh, uh, girls, you be nice to each other. Well, come <laughs> what? on. What? It's a compliment. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> Our girls are young women now. When did that happen? 
What's the matter, darling? Gotta get out of the rain. Scalpel? So you girls are sisters, c'est bien ça? Twin, Twin sisters. sisters. Mm. Daughters of the famous Captain Blaskovich himself. Except for Abby here, she's a friend of the family. We know he was here, ma'am. He came here looking for something, and then he helped us fight the Nazis, and suddenly he was gone. Plus de terre, s'il te plaît, Jacques. You have antibiotics, Jack? Oh, poor Jacques, he's a mute. Why do you want antibiotics? He's got peritonitis. Oh, and how do you know this? Swollen abdomen, rapid breathing, his peritoneum is inflamed, which will eventually lead to sepsis and death. He needs antibiotics. Oh, you come over here, you help? I'm cool. Ma'am, please. Everyone calls me Juju. Will you help us find him, Juju? Wearing power suits? Yep. We don't have anything like this here. Can you handle the gun? Damn straight. Mm. Have you ever killed Nazis before? Listen, ma'am, we were born to kill Nazis. Tonton Stajak, born to kill Nazis. We ain't kill no Nazis. All right, Arthur, they don't need to know that. Very well, then. I may have an assignment suitable for two Nazi killers such as yourselves. After the previous General Lothar Brandt was ousted from power by Berlin, they sent in a new general to fight the Paris uprising. This general is located in a zeppelin called the Nachtfalter. Kill him first. Then. We may proceed with finding your father. Climb down there. I sneak up from the left. You sneak up from the right. Corner him and kill him. Man, are you crying? I'm the fucking crying. A little nauseous is all. You could have flaked out on me. Hell no. Well, let's go then, little Miss Blaskowitz. Just do what Mom and Daddy would do. Daddy's hurt. Bleed him somewhere. We can do this. We can find him. Are you kidding me? We got this shit, sis. Fucking A. Remember, girls, you are the daughters of the man who killed Adolf fucking Hitler. You were born to do this. Your target 
General Winkler should be in the front end of the Zeppelin. Copy that, Abster. All right, here we go. Just looking around for collectibles. Wish like I could some. Just kick all these Nazis into space. Information computers. Important tutorial information can be found by picking up information computers located in the game's environment. Reading the information will educate you in how to use your weapons, abilities, and other important tools and skills. By collecting these information computers, you will be rewarded with valuable experience points and silver coins. Alright, now you could go under there if you want, but there's no need to do that. Nothing down there. Takedowns. Press R3 to perform a takedown. When a human-sized enemy's barrier has been destroyed, approach the enemy and press R3 to perform a frontal takedown. Sneaking up behind human-sized enemies allows you to perform silent takedowns, taking out targets while remaining undetected. Silent takedowns can be performed even if the enemy's barrier is intact. Alright, so we're going to do a silent takedown on this guy. A Neo-Soldat. <laughs> All right, we can pick up his weapon. This is a Blitzgewehr. All right, let's go ahead and activate this. We'll need the help of the twin sister. Bunch of ammo, I'll take that. Shared lives. You and your sister have shared lives. These shared lives are represented by the heart, arc heart icons next to your sister's portrait. If you and your sister bleeds out, one of those shared lives will be lost. When all shared lives are lost and one of you bleeds out, you will be reset to the start of the current map. So do whatever you can to protect your sister and prevent prevent her from bleeding out. All right. Also, uh, you want to check these little lockers whenever you see them. They've got ammo and other goodies. Got some more ammo. A whole bunch of ammo. I love it. All right, ammo's full. Got one of those cool mini computers. Probably has some valuable information on it. Weapon selection. Press and hold R1 to enter the weapon wheel. Release R1 to equip selected weapon. When you have additional handguns or heavy weapons in your inventory, press uh, left or right on the D-pad to toggle weapons within the same slots. All right, and then we can get a shared life here. Let me see if we get another heart. Got a Nazi. A Technica. Bad times for him. A little ridiculous that he didn't hear me, but whatever. Oh, I think they heard me. Take this! Oh, what the heck? Here they come, Jim. Whoa, what? Bring them on, Okay, I got taken down. I was trying to use my charge ability. Check up on the horse, baby. Alright, I'm dumb. I don't have it yet. I tried to use an ability I don't have. Keep going, go scar those pigs! Alright. That. Ooh, I like that. Oh, someone behind me. I can almost use my pep skill. That'll give us some armor. Alright. 
Pep skill. There we go. You're doing good, Chase. Well, thank you. All right. Oh. Thank you, Chase. Sounds like there's more. Hi. All right. So, pro tip: don't try to use abilities uh, that you don't have. Doesn't end up uh, well for you. Usually, end up dead like I did. All right, lockers. Got some stuff for me. Standard keypad. Standard keypads that are not connected to the Nazi security network need specific codes to unlock. These codes can be acquired by finding floppy disks in the nearby area and then reading them in a floppy disk terminal. So this key code or keypad right here needs a key code. Also, whenever you kill enemies, try to run over them because they usually have armor. And I believe sometimes health. But definitely armor. So, aggressive playstyles are rewarded well in this game. Well, to an extent. Can't be too aggressive because they the enemies do a lot of damage. At least on this difficulty setting. Silver coins. Collect silver coins to purchase character customization items. Pep signals, boosters, and weapon upgrades through the character and weapons tab in your journal. Silver coins can be found by looting killed enemies or by exploring the world. So, so I've got some silver coins there. Fifty silver. What other weapons can we try? Let's see, we got the storm gewehr. It's got the little scope on it, I like that. Floppy terminal. Please insert a floppy disk, so we need to find one. What is that, some coins? Take that. All these guys. Right. Don't pretty good on ammo and things. Us? Hey, go! <laughs> uh, Ooh, right in his neck. Need a computer so we can decrypt this. Okay, we've got a floppy disk. Take some coins. I think there was one other room. Wait, hold on. We'll turn around. Did I go back here before? No, I did not. Okay. I think we're all set. I think we looked at all these rooms. Actually, maybe not this one. Yeah, definitely not. Get all the currency I can, especially early game. Getting upgrades sooner will be fantastic. All right, so we got that floppy disk. Let's go back here. Der Nachtfalter door code. What is that? At the top. Verfugbaden Daten. Sorry, anyone who knows German. I will murder all of these words. Uh, let's see. Pico. Albert. Got some important information from security just now. General Winkler requested updated door codes on the Zeppelin. Said he didn't trust the previous security chief. Had him executed. Nasty business I don't want to get into. So the new code to crew quarters that you're in charge of is 8431. Commandant Siegel. 8431A. Oh, not this way. Eight four three one. These Nazi assholes did not expect the Blaskowitz sisters. Totally, dude. Right. 
What do we got in here? You can break open. Anytime you see these sorts of boxes, you can break, break them open and get goodies inside. Crouch. Press circle to crouch. Use crouch to negotiate narrow spaces. Move stealthily through guarded areas or hide behind cover. Alright, we got some robots over here. Bartender robots. Pep signals. Press up on the D-pad, on the D-pad to activate a pep signal and boost you and your sister. Press the touchpad to open your journal and change the active pep signal. Pep signals are inspirational actions that boost both you and your sister with powerful buffs and advantages. Pep sig signals can only be performed within a certain range of your sister and need to recharge once they've been used. And we got people angry at us. Hey, level one. One ability point plus 2% permanent damage. Awesome. Thanks, sis. Is that all? We could we'd have more enemies than that. Oh, there they are. They're not hitting him. That's weird. Alright, let's find another way to do this, guys. Hi! Ow! You can do this, dude! Pep signal! Never mind, Pep signal's not ready apparently. Switch to this one, I like this one. Fuck yeah, Jess, you're slaying it. Hi. I saw a guy back here. Did I? Nope. Oh, what? Oh, man, that hurt. Somebody back here. Alright, got him. I think we're all set. Wait. Ah. I right, got two guys back there. Got some more armor though. Ah, it's an armored dude. Thank you, so. Here's a pup. Now, it hasn't given us the tutorial on it yet, but when enemies are armored, you want to pay attention to the type of armor they have, because different weapons will penetrate that armor better. Let's backtrack. I want to make sure we pick up all the goodies. Okay, so this is where we got jumped. Come on, there's gotta be some coins in the bar. Really? Nothing? That's not. All right, we didn't go this way. Oh, look at this. Some armor, some silver coins. We got this back here. We got inside. Anything up top? No. Just leads to the other uh, yeah. keypad that was available.
So like back here we got these rooms or suites, whatever they are. Hey, new weapon. The Kugelgewehr. Alright, so this thing's uh, a very good close range weapon, almost like a shotgun. And uh, I have limited ammo with it, so let's put that away. And actually, when I switch weapons, I want something with more ammo to pop up, so I'll do that. Switch between these two. Pretty sure I killed all the enemies back here. Hey, what's this? A machine pistol! Oh. Enemy over there, huh? Switch to this. Switch to that. Not sure if I can stealth him here, but we're gonna try. Oh, he's got armor. Oh, well, he's dead. Boom! Oh. Pep signal. Thanks, dude. Oh right, I did not unlock my ability. Oh, what's going on here? Here we go. All right, so I can go over to character, and there's different abilities I can get. Let's check out the mind ones. So I could get first aid, gain plus 25 health and 25 armor after being revived by your sister. Damage immunity hey, is also increased from 2 to 4 me, seconds. Sis. Or I can get health plus, increases maximum health to 125. Ammo collector, find more ammunition when loading dead enemies. That could be useful, but I don't know. Ammo seems to be kind of everywhere. Uh, side dasher could also be good. Perform a side or perform a quick sideways dash by strafing sideways and pressing... L3. Uh, muscle increases maximum armor to 125. I think I'm going to go with this one. So this will cost me... Oh, this costs two. I only have one. Yeah, I don't have enough. Alright. Um, yeah, let me wait till I get one more of those gear ability point things and then I'll pick up that extra armor. Hey. But I think that'll be the most useful for me. All right, back here, we've got a secret room that you can get into. Jump up here. Uh, you can double jump by uh, pressing X while you're in midair. That. Got another box to break. Nice, 100 silver coins. That's awesome. Minimap. Use the minimap to navigate and get a tactical view of your surroundings. The map shows you and your sister's current location. Active mission objective icons, mission givers, enemies, and important Nazi commanders are also displayed on the minimap. All right, let's get out of this room. And let me check the other side just to make sure there's not any good deciding up here that I forgot about. But no, we're all set. Unless... What's this? No. I think we're good on this area after I grab this stuff. Yep. Can't wait to punch a Nazi in the face, Jess. <clears throat> Let's go.
Weapon upgrades. Press the touchpad to open your journal and enter the weapons tab. Customize your weapons with weapon upgrades and skins by spending silver coins or gold bars. Each weapon has unique upgrades that can give you strategic and tactical advantages. There are three brands of upgrades, Nautil, Temple, or Tempo, and Steer. Nautil is for accuracy, Tempo is for speed and fire rate, Steer, or Steyr, is for damage. If you match three of the same upgrades on a weapon, you will unlock a powerful brand bonus. Alright, so I haven't really experimented much with the upgrades, because I don't really know what I want yet. Um, but... Just for example, we could go to the Skirm, Sturm Gwir. These names are going to kill me. And uh, Receiver, for example. And uh, let's see. All of these are locked. Why are they locked? Oh, because actually I don't know why they're locked. Or maybe they're not. Let's see. So this one costs 350 modifiers plus penetration plus semi-automatic. Turns the Sturm Gewehr into a semi-automatic rifle that can shoot through covers, walls, and enemies. Uh, let's see. Accuracy goes up. Okay, yeah. So it increases accuracy. Fire rate goes down and DPS stays the same, I guess. I don't know. Like I said, I haven't really played with these yet, um, and I'm probably not going to here. But eventually, I'm upgrades on weapons and make them better. Alright, 50 silver coins. I have no idea who was talking there, but somebody was talking somewhere. Alright, we can get another life here. So, and I have three lives. I just love these cute little mini computers. Should be something interesting to read on it, too. Commanders, all enemies you encounter can trigger an alarm to call for reinforcements. If there's a Nazi commander, a commandant or kampf commandant pres uh, present in the area when an alarm is triggered, enemy reinforcements will be of higher level. All reinforcements entering combat after the commander has been killed will return to normal level. If you spot a commander, try to take him out first to avoid high level reinforcements from being called. So, this right here is the Commandant, and he is about to have a bad day. And nothing here. Well, I could jump up, I wonder if there's anything up here. They want power suits, huh? You can't be as cool as me. Uh oh. Well, it's go time. Oh, got him right in the nuts. Hey, level two. New ability point. If you didn't know what I did there, I was sprinting and then I ducked and you do an awesome slide. I quite enjoy that slide. Alright, so now that I have another skill point, let's go to muscle and get the increased armor. 125 is my maximum now. Perfect. Okay, let me 
do the loop up here, make sure there's no goodies that I missed. I don't think there actually is though. Oh, hi guys. He's got armor, I gotta be careful with him. Got him. Ooh, I like that weapon though. Let's see. I'm gonna get that out and that. Ah, crap. Well, thanks. Pep. Keep up the good work, so. You got it. I don't know if there's more enemies coming or not. Now well, there's enemies up ahead. While I'm moving up, I want to pick up some shinies. Oh, I can get some health here. Foods. Good. Hey, it's Nazis going down. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, how are you alive? You're killing it, sis. Fuck me now. That's a few enemies over there. Commandant in the back. He's probably calling reinforcements. Hi. <laughs> awesome. All right. Well, there's lots of food in here. Should be able to get back to full health and all that. Get some ammo. We've got this terminal. Crush, press L3 to sprint into enemies and objects. Press X and then circle to perform a power slam attack. X and then circle, I definitely haven't been doing that. The crush ability allows you to crush weak enemies and objects like ventilation, grills, wooden doors, and crates by sprinting into them. You can also perform a power slam to crush enemies and objects from above. All right, so sprint, X and then circle. Oh, I see, all right. Well, I'll give it a shot on somebody. Like I said, the invisibility wasn't really doing it for me, so maybe that'll be better. All right, back in this room. No, I don't want the machine pistol. I don't know if there's a way to stop it from automatically switching weapons, but it drives me crazy when it does it. Alright, looking around, got coins and such. Health if I needed it. Okay, that's pretty much everything. Moving on. You scared, Jess. Do I look scared to you? It's okay, Jess. I get scared sometimes too. Well, I never get scared, and that's that. Power jump. Press X and then X again while in air to perform a power jump. With the power suit, you can perform a power jump to reach higher grounds and to find alternative routes. Up we go. Whoops. Okay. 
Okay, we can go that way or this way. This way is fine. Hatchet and knife throwing. Press R3 to throw melee weapons. A lot of useful weapons can be found on the Nazi controlled streets of New Paris. Among those are melee weapons that you will be able to throw for stealthy distance kills. These weapons cannot be thrown while standing too close to your target. If you are in close range to an enemy, it will instead result in a melee attack. So I can just be like, hey you, you're dead. is full. Okay, we need to go up. Jump on top of that first. Hey Jess, you went hunting with Dad. What did you talk about? Ain't telling so. Why don't you go hunting with him yourself sometime? I only hunt Nazis, Jess. Not animals. Alright, let me try this. Oh, let's see. How was it again? Aha! Oh, pff, that doesn't work. Oh, whatever. I can break through it like this. It lied to me. Go up, but is there something back here? Yes, there is. Damn it. So, where am I supposed to go up here? Yeah. Or maybe not. What's going on? Ah. Journal. Access your journal by pressing the touchpad. The journal contains missions, character, weapons, tutorials, and collectibles. Access the journal when you want to set a new mission to active. Receive more information about your current objective, spend silver coins and ability points, and view collectibles and important tutorial information. <coughs> Not so obvious platform over here. Oh, don't over jump it. That'll get you a hundred silver coins, so definitely worth it. Oh god, over jumped! Oh, I'm okay. Okay. Oh crap. This guy's got some serious armor. Oh, I'm throwing. Hey. Knives, that's not a good idea. Apparently I have the ability to unlock 73 weapon upgrades with my current amount of money. That's kind of ridiculous. Flashlight! Press right on the D-pad to equip your flashlight. When you have the flashlight equipped, use right on the D-pad to turn it on or off. Sometimes you will reach dark areas where you'll have to use your flashlight. When you equip your flashlight, a one-handed weapon will be automatically added to your right hand. Alright, flashlight time. I wonder if there's any goodies on that side. I don't know if I can actually get there or not. Uh, that might be a little too high for me. I'm gonna try though. This might be dangerous. Maybe. Aha! Hey, there is something up here. Grenade throwing. Press R1 to throw grenades. Grenades are effective against all types of enemies. Just remember to stay 
out of the grenade's blast radius. Will do. Okay. Going down. Huh. Is there a better way to get over there? Let's go over the side. Yeah. There we go. Alright, 50 silver coins and we are level 3, another new ability point. Flashlight can go away. Ah, look what I got. A mini computer. Could be some interesting information on it. Enemy barrier. Some enemies have protective barriers that need to be destroyed before you can do damage to them. Some weapons work better against soft barriers, and others are more efficient against hard barriers. Check the icon next to the ammo counter, counter and use the weapon that matches the enemy's barrier to destroy it quicker. So that's what I was talking about before. You can see the different uh, types of ammo will take down different types of enemies. So uh, if I understand the two types correctly, this current weapon will be better against soft barriers. go this way. You know, I'm getting somewhat low on ammo on the other weapons, so let's switch to this one. And we're gonna have to be careful in here if I remember correctly, there's a big mean enemy. So I might want to do some stealth kills before I try to engage him. Or I could try to focus on it. Let's see we're in some sort of casino. Hey, go! Crap. Well, so much for stealth. It's go time! Alright, where's the big guy? There he is. Oh, jeez. Hey, where? Alright, let's... That needs a different type of gun. This gun will work. Yeah, working on it. Alright, let's go back this way. Maybe I can get some distance. Super soldier! Keep a distance. I'm gonna teach that Nazi commander a lesson. Getting low. Crap. Got him. It's gonna take out that super soldier. Yeah, working on it. Where'd he go? Ooh, splash. I'm gonna kick the Snapchat's ass. Oh, Keep it up, sis. Out, You're a goddamn champ. Pep. I believe in you, sis. Thank you, sis. There he is. Hi. I'm going for the super soldier. Oh. Oh, God. Don't die on me. Almost got him. 
He's dead. Alright, let's mop up the easy ones. Where are they at? Oh, crap! Pep! Oh, crap, I need... I need to get out of here. I have the we Oh, give me that. Coming for you. Oh. This isn't the weapon I thought I had equipped. See, I thought I had this one. Oh! God, how many are there? Okay, we good? I think we're good. Yay! Alright, success. Alright, let's take a look around, get the shinies. Uh, I could get a shared life here, but we actually don't need it. What did that say? Lies maxed out, yeah. Nice Nazi club they have here. Too bad I had to come in and ruin things. Shinies out here, but apparently not. Check the tables if you're looking to get every last coin you can. And some health. Check out here. I don't think I did. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, here we go. I was gonna say, I'm pretty sure there's some coins we can get out here. 100 silver coins. Don't miss that. Hey, Soph. I'll take it. Armor's full. Alright, and don't miss this collectible right here. It's a cassette tape. Berlin wird bald einen Angriff auf mich starten. Wir müssen vorbereitet sein. Jeder, der mir treu ergeben bleibt, wird seinen gerechten Lohn erhalten. Wenn die Zeit. All right, this is Lothar recording number one, General Lothar Brandt. Berlin is going to launch an attack on me very soon. We have to be prepared. Everyone who stays loyal to me will be greatly rewarded when the time... And then they're static. Totally weird. Passes. All right, let's go ahead and activate or open this high security door. Help so if we'll go grab the other one. I can't do this by myself. Eventually. How are you holding up, Jess? Fine as cream gravy. Yeah, you can go under there, but no point. Heads up, girls. We just got intel on the general. He's apparently trying out a new range of Nazi power suits. So be careful. All right? Sure thing, Abby. 
Fifty silver coins. Uh, armor's full. Shared lives are maxed out. Uh, what's this? Ah, ammo. There's some more ammo over here. Alright, this dude is no joke, so just be very careful with him. Pep. Oh crap, don't let him get close to you, it's a bad idea. Ow! Right, I'm moving up top. Ammo. I am going to switch to the Sturm Gewehr. Oh, bad time to reload. Can be so hard to find. Oh, there he is. Oh, you sneaky. Right, I'm going for some armor. Ah, oh, crap. She's down. All right, sister's down. I'll get her. Hopefully, she starts limping over towards me. I got it. Get up. All right, back in action. The heck is he? Oh. Take that. Oh, got him with that grenade. That was good. I'll take this armor. Called in reinforcements, and we are level four. Oh, he's almost lost his shields. Laser, give me that health. Get this armor. Got it. Where is he? Hmm. See him. Wait, there he is. Ah, buddy, take that! Oh, crap. Should have reloaded. Or I should have switched weapons. Oh, no! Where do you think you're going? Shove his ass into the jet engine, so. Oh, let's make it. Oh, no!
race. I'm sleeping over. Cool. Children, can you give us a moment? Children. Hey, what's that, Abby? A listening device. Looks like something out of Arthur and Kenneth. You built this thing? Yep. Who are Arthur and Kenneth? You're telling me you haven't read the covert adventures of Arthur Pennington and Kenneth Van Holshauser? Man, what rocket you've been living under? Here, take it. No time for reading fiction. So Arthur and Kenneth are super spies, right? And they go on. No, all shut up, shut up. Listen. Calls, no letters. And I searched everywhere. Well, my agents informed me that he left the country under a false identity about four weeks ago. But after that, the trail went cold. Anya, did you notice anything peculiar about his demeanor lately? No. I don't know. Depression, maybe. Sometimes he doesn't talk for a day. Just like in the asylum. You know how he is. Always brooding. Yeah. I can't go after him, Grace. I have to stay here and watch over my girls. You are the head of the FBI. Isn't there anything you can do? Listen, trust me, if there was anything any of the agencies could do, girl, you know I would be all over that shit. You know what the bottom line is? He doesn't want to be found, Anya. And if B.J. fucking Blaskowitz doesn't want to be found, there is nothing and no one on God's green earth that's going to find his ass. Yeah. Yeah. It's fucked. Screw this. They won't look for him. No one ever does anything. Losers, Scott. No, we got to do something. What, what, what would Arthur and Kenneth do? Yeah, they're characters in a book, Jess. I, I know that, asshole. I'm thinking out loud. I'm getting something from upstairs. There's nothing up there. <laughs> Whoa. Wow. None of you knew this was here? Negative. What the hell is this place? Check this out. That's Seth's handwriting. Who's this? Codename Blackbird. Paris Catacombs. There you have it. That's your lead. He's in Paris. You know, if we say something, they aren't gonna do jack shit. Well, I guess it's just up to us then. I say, what time is it? I think it's time for Arthur and Kenneth to illustrate this sticky wicket. <laughs> Fuck yeah! Mm -hmm. <laughs> you guys are weird. That is a professional. What do you think you're doing? We're going to the hamburger bar, mother. Abby, get back here right fucking now. You're breaking up. Abby! <laughs> <laughs> Let me show you something. Whoa. Where'd you get these power suits? Made them. All the Nazi generals have these nowadays, so you will need it. Holy fucking shit. You're pretty awesome, Abby. I just finished one of Seth's projects. It was his dying wish. 
I have more things I'm working on in the cargo hold. No wonder Grace wants you to join her advanced research division. Maybe she'll send you to Juvie instead. Sounded pretty mad you stole a ride. You think she cares what her mother thinks? I don't care what anyone thinks. Are you Blackbird? And who might you girls be? I did not want to do that shit again. Well, stewardess, sis. Just like Daddy told us. Winkler is out of the picture. Now come back to the catacombs. Juju wants to talk to you. On it. Congratulations, girls. General Winkler is dead. You really were born to kill Nazis, hmm? Well, you are the daughters of the man who killed Hitler. So it shouldn't be a surprise, I guess. This is a big step for the resistance. Come back to me and Jacques, so we can make plans for our next move. Juju out. Okay, our first mission, General Wink Winkler, is complete. We leveled up again, we're all the way up to level 5 now. And we've got three skill points that we can use. I can get increased maximum health for just one skill point. Let's go ahead and do that. Let's get that up to 125. And let's see what else is available to us. Let's see. Dual wielder enables dual wielding of one-handed firearms. Double tap uh, triangle to activate dual wield. Super soldat hunter enables silent takedowns on super soldaten. That could be pretty good. I wonder if it... I don't know what it's... Uh, which enemies are classified as super soldaten, but I would imagine... Anything we ran into minus the boss was. So that's very tempting. I'll need another skill point for that. Bigger guns allows you to carry heavy weapons dropped by enemies. And then under power... We could pick up cloak for... Ooh, for five? That's not worth five. Like I said, I'm not a... Well, actually, it might be worth five with... When paired... With the Super Soldat Hunter. So maybe. And I do have 1,270 coins for weapon or possibly other upgrades. So I'll look into those and figure out what I want to spend my money on when we start the next video. And then of course we've got all of our tutorial stuff here. A whole bunch of information. And under collectibles we've got one floppy disk and one cassette tape. Alrighty, so we are all done here. Thank you for watching, and I will see you next time.